Now in this video po, we are going to familiarize you sa basics po ng port to port. Now I know ang channel ng uh, ang pangalan ng channel ko is uh, online third mate. Okay? Now this is usually the trabaho ni second mate. Okay? Route planning, passage planning, yeah, make two mistake, but okay? Bilang isang uh, deck officer then bilang isang third officer, dapat kahit pa paano may fam may konting idea ka, may familiarization ka kahit pa paano on distance tables. Now Ito pong app na gagamitin natin is this is not intended for navigation. I would also like to thank si uh, Sir from Mariner's Guide for the software that uh, we're about to uh, use. Okay? Now, pag sampa po ninyo ng barko, eh, meron po kayong similar app na kagaya nito na you are about to uh, use. No? So, let me get my uh, spectacles. No? So, again, ang uh, port to port po is para po yan sa uh, waypoint making. Okay? Para alam mo yung iyong uh, mga chart na gagamitin, ilan yung distance mo, para makompute na agad yung mga fuel na kailangan, ROBs. Okay? And, uh, yeah, let's crack on with it. Okay? So, again, to use this app, okay? To use this app, alimbawa, uh, mag-enter tayo ng pangalan ng port. Uh, Corpus Christi, Texas, or United States. Okay? Tapos, next port natin is, alimbawa, nag-email na si Charterer. Okay? Mag-antay ka sa email ni Charterer. Okay? Uh, next port mo is, Oh, dito ka, Portsmouth, uh, let's say US. Oh. Oh, ayan na. Okay, these are your waypoints. You've got 15 uh waypoints. Okay, you've got 15 waypoints na na nakalatag na sa iyo. Ito na, meron ka ng name, latitude, longitude, ECA to previous, to previous traveled and remaining. Okay? So, again, halimbawa, uh, speed ng isang bulk carrier normally around 14 knots. Okay? Pero kapag ka malakas ang kuryente, Okay? Tinutulak ka, I mean, roughly 18. Okay? So, again, okay, pwede nating uh, uh, makuha na yung mga details dito. You've got 1,837 nautical miles. Okay? And uh, you've got a total of, okay, a total of, it's gonna take you 5 days, 11 hours, and then 12 minutes. Okay? Umalis ka ng May 31, and then darating ka ng June 6. Okay, so 5 to 6 days. Normally, syempre, kung may mga panahon pa, may mga uh, adverse weather conditions, okay, may mga engine trouble, okay, ship trouble or something, okay, mag -variant. Pero, this is your ETA, okay? June 6, 2019, okay? Example lamang po ito, ha? Example lamang po ito, okay? And, uh, yun ang it's gonna take you 5 days, 11 hours, 12 minutes. Now, pwede rin naman po nating mano-mano yan, okay? Okay, pwede rin naman pong... Ah, uh, pwede rin naman pong mano-mano 'yan, no? Sa so, so, totoo lang, okay? Uh, let's say ano ba yung distance? Okay, 1836.85. Accurate tayo, eh. Huwag natin round off. Okay, so divide natin to, uh, divide natin, ah, sorry, sorry, sorry. Ah, uh, yeah, divide to uh, 14. Okay? Kasi yun yung uh, 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 speed natin, okay? To get yung time, distance over speed, okay? So, you've got 131. Now, div ilang araw yan? Okay, divide natin to 24. You've got 5 days. Ayan, no? nakuha natin yung, uh, ito, ito, nakuha natin yung 5 days. Okay, minus natin yung 5. Kasi kailangan natin variable is yung 466815. Okay, yung mahaba na yan. Okay, times natin to 24. How many? Okay, how many hours? You've got uh, 11 hours. Okay, 511. Ayan, no? o, 11. Uh, minus natin yung 11, okay? I need yung minutes, okay? I need yung minutes times 60. Uh, see, you've got it here, okay? 5 days, 11 hours, 12 minutes, okay? Pero hindi yan accurate, okay? Rough lang yan, okay? Pero at least yung mano-mano alam din natin, okay? So, again, ulitin ko lamang po, eh, pag sumampa ka ng barko, eh, you have a similar app just like this. This is not intended for uh, navigation, no? So, tandaan po natin na meron tayong mga emission control areas okay just take you lang in box here on load light zones load line zones all right this is your uh, emission control area okay marble zones okay kung pwede na pwede na magdump ng ano ng uh, uh, food waste okay or uh, let's just say yung uh, yung uh, ship reporting areas ayan yung mga pink okay traffic schemes ayan oh uh, see can you see it can you see it uh, i-zoom in natin okay zoom in natin oh ayan oh uh, uh, this is your uh, traffic scheme. So, ayan, uh, uh, you have your traffic schemes here. Okay, now, sa barko po, usually, okay, kapag zoom out mo siya, tapos ito waypoint mo, usually may mga rectangle yan na nakalagay dito, indicating ko ano yung appropriate na paper chart na gagamitin mo as a 
'di ba? As a deck officer. Okay? Now, hindi po siya ito, ulitin ko lang again because baka mamaya may magreklamo. Again, ulitin ko. This is not intended for navigation. Guide lamang po itong ginagawa ko. Pag sampa mo sa barko, merong official na software na ibibigay si UKHO, United Kingdom Hydrographic Office. Bayad po constantly ni kumpanya mo yung license para sa software na yon. Okay? Constant po yung binabayaran because we are using yung uh, uh, hydrographic details na ginawa sa survey ni UKHO from the maps. Okay? Usually kapag uh, zinom in mo to, may lalabas na uh, mga rectangles dito indicating kung ano yung uh, appropriate na chart on this particular waypoint. Okay? Uh, meron tayong tinatawag na MBA paper charts. Although sa mga companies, mostly of the companies today, they don't really pay careful attention sa paper charts. Uh, paper charts, okay? Uh, they pay caref uh, careful attention sa ECDIS. Okay? Yung, uh, ang ECDIS nila is updated, running uh, 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 smoothly. Okay? But on my previous company po, okay? Uh, we still stick to the old methods. Celestial na and paper charts. Why? Because, eh, hindi mo alam kung kailan magmamalfunction yung Uh, yung equipment Okay So again Kung ikaw ay let's say Nasa senior high school pa lang Okay And let's just say Mastered mo ang uh, trigonometry at physics Okay Kayang kaya mo magkapitan ng barko Okay Because that's, that's basically it Okay e, Umiikot ka lang sa trigonometry Tsaka sa physics Only pinalaki mo lang siya Okay So basically that's the job of a seafarer Okay Focus ka lang on those two Different topics Trigonometry and physics Dude Pwede ka mag-apat na bara Okay? So, again, sa chart po na ito, I mean, sa app po na ito, okay, linawin ko lang, eh, hindi po ito yung uh, uh, talagang detailed na iyong uh, version, I should say. Okay? Now, guide lamang po ito. So, again, uh, familiarization, again, pwede ka mag-generate ng report, generates a, uh, uh, a PDF file, ito, ipiprint niya itong text na to, Okay? Or, pwede ka mag-export ng root na pwede mo nang i-print. Okay? Pwede mo na siyang i-print. Okay? So, now, after mo makuha yung mga distance, ade, pwede na tayong mag-send uh, kay uh, uh, yung charterer. Okay? Na, hey, uh, our next voyage is gonna take us 5 days. Okay? So, we need more fuel. So, ngayon, eh, start na ng bunkering op uh, operation. So, lalapit sa'yo yung mga bunker barge or the... This is your uh, appropriate na uh, uh, fuel for your next voyage. Again, nilinawin ko, pag sampa mo ng barko, pwedeng MBA or there are other softwares pa na pwede mong gamitin. Na, kapag ginamit mo siya, eh, lalabas dito yung appropriate na paper chart. And at the same time, kung uh, you have ENCs na required on this particular area na kailangan mong i-update. Okay? Lalabas dito yung mga ENCs na kailangan mo on this voyage. And at the same time, kung kailangan siyang, ulitin ko, i-update. Okay? So, again, hope you've learned something new. And uh, be happy, be healthy. And most importantly, to God be all the glory. Keep safe, boys. And good luck on being the next third officer of your ship. God bless.